Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. She plays the wise cracking assistant to Cookie Lions on my favorite Fox TV show, Empire. And she has absolutely no problem shining among the other stars on the show. Take a look. Why you gotta tinkle all the time? Yo, how much I tinkle and when I do it is none of your business. That's between me and the toilet. You pregnant? What kind of question is that? Ain't that a pregnancy test in your hand? Yeah, but these things don't even mean anything, so. What's it say? You know, it really doesn't matter what it says because every single one of these are inconclusive. So, and Damn, it's just Becky! How many of those you done took? Girl. <laughs> Please welcome down to the circle to Rhonda Jones. Yay! Yeah. 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 Hey, yes, ma'am. You better come in here, shoe. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Good. Good to see you. Good hey, hey. Have a seat. Purple marks your spot. Purple marks my spot. Oh, my spots. goodness. We are so happy to have you down to the circle. Thank y'all for having me. You look the amazing. Circle. Thank you. I try. You know how I try. I'm I'm sure. Sure. You do whatever. <laughs> okay, so let's get into this empire. First of all, I love the show. Mm -hmm. And I love you on the show. You're me very funny. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Me too! Me <laughs> too! <laughs> okay, but, at, but you're, you're, you have such an amazing cast that you're acting with. I Absolutely. Mean, to just be thrown in this type of talent, what is that like for you? And how are you inspired when you're working on this set? Oh, my God. It's so surreal. It's still surreal for me. Um, I still haven't had a chance to let it all soak in. Mm -hmm. But uh, to be able to work with all these, like, Award yeah, nominee, yeah, award winning, yeah, like, like Taraji Terrence, Forrest Whitaker. Yes. yes. And I remember the first time I met Forrest, he was, oh man, he's such a sweet soul. I met him at the airport and um, it was my first time meeting him. I knew he was due on set, uh -huh. but we hadn't officially met one another yet. Mm -hmm. So it was a guy, he was bugging me, kicking the back of my chair, like, hey, is that Forrest? I'm like, mm -hmm. I don't know, you ask him. <laughs> And when we finally got off the plane, I said, you know, I'm going to go up to him and I'm going to just say, hey, you know, I'll see you tomorrow morning. Right. You know, it's me. <laughs> wow. So I walked up to him. I said, hey. He said, hey, how you doing? And I said, you know, we work together. He said, oh, we do. I said, okay. yeah. Uh, we play on the show Empire. I play Cookies and Sister. He said, oh, bro, you look different. I said, oh, I know I'm cute in person. Yeah. <laughs> and, and then um, he said, you know what? Um, I'm so excited to be on the show. Do you need me to help you with your bags? I'm like, dude, you're Forrest Whitaker. No, I don't want you to help me with my bags. Oh, I love that. And it just so happened my car never showed up. And he offered me a ride. And I said, no. And he said, I promise I'm not trying to kidnap you. And I said, as if I'm not kidnap worthy. <laughs> so he looked at me like, okay, you're crazy, sister. You're crazy. Right. But no, he was so crazy. sweet and humble. And he kept saying, you sure you don't need a ride? And I'm like, no, no, sir, I'm good. You mm -hmm. know, we just met. So no, it's okay. But yeah. he's such a sweet soul. Everybody who are at the stature that they are at mm -hmm. are super humble. Mm -hmm. And that's what I love about each and every last one of the cast on the show. Yeah. So inquiring minds want to know, <laughs> what were you doing before you got cast on this project? I used to be a butcher. A butcher? Like a meat butcher? Cutting meat. I used to Girl. do I used to be an assistant manager at a shoe store and I was also an assistant director of nutritional services at a nursing home. Wow. wow. Yeah. Cooking for but, but look at cooking God. for the elder. Just look, all and ain't nothing but God. Come you on. Know? I know that's right. <laughs> so then what was the audition process like for you? Um, it was a little weird, but okay. <laughs> um, my brother, he was the one who found out about the show. Mm -hmm. Um and an engineer from Chicago. Mm -hmm. uh, told my brother about him. I was like, hey, I think this would be a dope opportunity for your sister. Terrence Howard is looking for female rappers in their 20s. Mm -hmm. I thought Terrence Howard was trying to come out with a hustle and flow label. Right. So I'm, I'm going in thinking I was originally going to rap for Terrence Howard. Right. And as I went in, I never saw Terrence, and I kept saying, where's Terrence? Right. <laughs> I had no clue I was auditioning for a show. I thought I was going in to rap. And wow. when I finally, and I remember uh, them asking for a headshot. I had no clue what a headshot was. But you had bars. I went to to Walgreens and printed out my Instagram pictures. That's all right. <laughs> and I, I, I'm not sure if I ever told it anybody, so, but it wasn't saying. the eight by ten. Right. It was the four by four. Right. <laughs> the iPhone got the good portrait on it. You but right. I didn't have an iPhone. I had Android, so you know mm. the pictures were blurry. Oh, so. Right. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so you had That's like a dog of a tape. Yes, ma'am. Man, I bet you won't rap. I bet you I will. Do uh, it. Hurry up now. I'm a bad mother. Shut your mouth, just a. Another little shorty from the south side. Hey. The one they love to talk about, hotter than the summertime, sizzle like peroxide. See, I got, I got what you need. I'm too overqualified. All the mother people need to be disqualified. I'm too certified. I ain't got to justify that I'm hotter. They keep sleeping on me like a lullaby. Hey. <laughs> and on that good note, we will be back with more from Toronto Jones. So you do not want to go anywhere. Stay right here.
Bad yes. Bad <laughs> Welcome back. We're here with Taronda Jones, one of the stars of Empire. Yes. Taronda. Yes. How has your life changed? Drastically. Um, <laughs> like a 360. Uh, I get to do things that I never imagined doing. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of people don't know it was my first time flying on a plane since I landed the wow. world of Empire. My first oh, time wow. getting my driver's license. My first time actually living on my own and really? having my own place. Yes. Wow. So Empire has definitely uh, okay. changed my life. Drastically. The glow up is real. Oh, okay. the glow up is so real. Yes. <laughs> yes. So no spoilers, but what can you tell us about this season? What kind of things can we expect? Um, people die. Oh. Dead. 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 Every Dead. season, Dead. people Dead. die. Dead down to the Empire. <laughs> that's it. And then right. there's that. Right. So that's all we can know is that folks is not going to People leave. die. <laughs> OK. Well, guess what? That's the answer. In lieu of your last rap uh, excursion that just ha happened in our last segment, uh, will there be any new music on the horizon? Absolutely. I'm working on a single. It's called Get the Bag and Go. Bags. You know, the go yes. Bags, 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 money bags, bags, money bags. bags go. <laughs> and um, I just recently put out a single called God Got It. Mm -hmm. um, I got it. Featuring Terrell Carter, who mm -hmm. is one of the cast on... That's it right there! Oh, that's me! Oh, that's Come on! <laughs> that's featuring sharp. Terrell Carter, who's one of the cast on the show, who's an amazing singer, by the way. He blessed the track, and um, I got a lot of great feedback from it. It talks about my upbringing in Chicago and how mm -hmm. I come from nothing, how I made it to something. I know, that's mm -hmm. why. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Hello, somebody. <laughs> now, was music your first love? Because, you know, sometimes we kind of, we're doing this, we end up here, and... So was it your first love Absolutely. or did you always see Absolutely. I have been rapping since I was 10, 11 years old. Nice. And um, I got inspired to rap by my older sister, mm -hmm. uh, Tammy. And she used to just be writing raps. And I used to snatch papers out of her notebook and then go to school and recite the raps. And people were like, right. you cold? And I'd right. be like, I know. And so one day my sister called me and was like, you stealing my stuff again? Right. <laughs> <laughs> you stealing my stuff? And I'm like, right. okay. And she was just like, write your own. So I started writing my own. And then I got colder than her. Right. What's up? Right. <laughs> Hold on. That's a battle. That's a battle. That's a battle. Now, will you be doing any, uh, will you be performing on Empire? Like doing, you know, because they do a lot of performances. Uh -oh. I'm just saying. Uh-oh, you know. what? No spoilers. <laughs> People die. That's what I said. <laughs> I said what I said. <laughs> Listen, you have been a treat. You are so, so funny. You might have some comedy chops on you, too. I just recently took... Uh, improv class. Nice. I just graduated Ooh. from my first improv class. Congratulations. Um, yes. Thank yes. you. Thank you. They you said know. I'm a natural. I didn't even know, but I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, you know what? We are so happy that you came down to the circle. Thank, Thank you, you so much for visiting, me. visiting us. You're always welcome. You can catch Taronda and the rest of the cast on Empire Wednesday nights at 8, 7 central on Fox. And the conversation always continues at sistercircletv.com. Yes.